This is an idea for the birds. The bun pan can be used as a tool to make a bun pan bird feeder wreath. Back to help me make it is our audience member, Jessica Rotkowitz, who is wearing a bun Hello. pan on her head. <laughs> Very clever. Thank you. So um, we're using fresh cranberries as decoration. The birds are going to, you know, require decoration in their, in their <laughs> suet patties. And uh, we're using six cups of uh, okay. bird seed mix and one cup of peanuts. All of this is bird feeder grains and nuts and a cup of dried cranberries. And we have rendered our own suet. And it, suet is really the fat that's around the kidneys of uh, the cow. So once this is all mixed up, then you can just fill the bunt pan and just press it all in and put it in the refrigerator or in the freezer and get it really, really firm. Birds are not gonna care if there's cranberries. <laughs> they are, all they want really is that bird seed and that, well, they like peanuts too. They're hungry. And uh, I feed a lot of birds. I have like 80 bird oh, feeders great. on my property. Yeah, and I've, I've gotten an awful lot of different birds to come. So this um, will be... Yeah, so get that nice and firm. Mm. Really press it. And don't put it out on a warm day. Put this out in sub-freezing weather. Okay. Yes, because otherwise it, it might melt. So I see you made little ones there too. You can make little ones. Those are perfect um, for yeah, gifts. in those little bundlelet pans. Uh -huh. And then we have one to churn out. All put right. a dish underneath and oh, it comes right out of this fantastic bun pan. Look, there it is. Wow. And you can hang what a that. Great pan. Remember, in cold weather, I hope the birds in your neighborhood are hungry. Isn't that great? This is great. Yeah, very nice. nice.